wanna be anybody else. What is up? Welcome back to another video. Hey, I'm Lizanne. If you're new, welcome to my channel. I am happy to have you. For this video, I am back with another episode of Creating Famous People on The Sims 4. Episode 1, we created Marilyn Monroe. Episode 2, we created Blake Lively. Episode 3, we created Lucy Hale. Episode 4 was Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen. Episode 5 was Jenna Ortega. Episode 6 was Selena Gomez. Episode 7 was Hilary Duff, which leads us to Episode 8. So for Episode 8 of Creating Famous People on The Sims 4, I am going to be creating Abby Lee Miller from the hit TV show Dance Moms. So if you want to see me create Abby Lee Miller and want to know some facts, then keep on watching. Here are the pictures I'm going to use and onto the facts. Abby Miller was born on September 21st, 1965. Her full name is Abigail Lee Miller, but we all know her by just Abby Lee. She was born in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania to Mary and Lorraine Miller, a dance teacher and studio owner, and George L. Miller. Her nationality is British American and Irish American. She's the only child. She never married and has no children. But she has a dog. She had a dog named Broadway Baby who died in December of 2012. It is mentioned on her dance TV show. Um, Abby Lee's favorite colors are red and black, and she has green eyes and dark brown hair. Abby is an American television personality. She started dancing at a young age in her mother's studio. Besides dancing, she also, in her younger years, was a Girl Scout. She took clarinet, sewing, roller skating, and ice skating lessons, and even attended charm school. At age 14, she opened her own dance studio, the Abby Lee Dance Company. She's taught somewhere, somewhere between 3,000 and 4,000 student, students since opening her first dance studio in 1980. In 2011, she started a reality TV show on Lifetime called Dance Moms. It ran for eight, eight years, 2011 to 2019, using her mom's old studio as their dance studio. I absolutely love Dance Moms. It was a great show. It was very dramatic and... There was a, it, but and very there was very drama, but it was so good, and I I highly recommend watching Dance Moms if you never watched Dance Moms. It is an amazing show. I love it. <laughs> there is three spinoffs from Dance Moms, which are Abby's Ultimate Dance Competition. It ran for two seasons. Then there's Dance Moms Miami and Dance Moms Abby Studio Rescue, which both only ran for seven episodes. Abby has been a guest judge on Dancing with the Stars. In 2014, she published a book called Everything I Learned About Life I Learned in Dance Class. In 2015, Miller opened a new studio set up in Los Angeles called ALDC LA. Um, if you watch Dance Moms, you will see that throughout the seasons of her opening it up. It's really cool. On December 3rd, 2000 and on December 3rd, 2010, Miller fle fleed for bankruptcy after owning more than 40 400,000 in back taxes to the IRS. She served 8 months in prison from 2017 to 2018. In 2016, she appeared on the Eric Andre show season 4. On May 4th, 2020, she announced that she was leaving Dance Moms and Lifetime after nine years. In April 2018, she was diagnosed with a rare cancer, Burkitt lymphoma, a type of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. It all, it, she almost died because they, before they knew what it was. It was that bad. Uh, after spinal surgery in September of that year, Mil Miller's lymphoma went into remission, and she began physical therapy to learn how to walk. She went back to Lifetime and filmed one more season after her cancer went into remission. In June 2023, she launched a podcast called Leave It on the Dance Floor about behind the scenes and secrets of dance bombs. As Abby continues to regain her strength in order... To one day walk again, she opened up to Entertainment Tonight about a recent setback 
The dance instructor shattered her right tibia and fibula after her power wheelchair crashed into a wall in March 2023. She is still currently learning to walk. Um, Abby Lee Miller is a huge inspiration to the dance community. She's an inspiration to me, and I wish her so much happiness and recovery in her life. I truly believe that she will walk again. Um, I love you, Abby. I hope you see this. <laughs> and, yeah. I will just add her up to the gallery so you guys can download her if you would like. Please remember that I do use custom content, so make sure you click that custom content link. I get all my custom content from The Sims Resource or Cruise Forge. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me while we create Abby Lee Miller on The Sims 4. Um, make sure you tag Abby Lee Miller in this so that she can see it. I would love for her to see it. Let me know what you guys thought. Leave all your comments down below. Give this video a big thumbs up. Follow me on all my social medias. Those are always down there. And always remember that a little magic always goes a long way. And I'll speak to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.